Hey everyone, and welcome to the Grow Hemp series. Today, we'll be showing you an industrial hemp grow from seed to flower. So this grow is a little different from all the other grow logs because today we'll be doing an industrial hemp grow as opposed to a medicinal hemp grow that all the other grow logs feature. Industrial hemp is grown not for CBD, but for their stalks, leaves, and seeds to be used in everything from food to clothing. Here, I'm starting with some raw consumable hemp seeds bought from a major online rainforest website. And although I've heard mixed stories about whether or not consumable hemp seeds bought online can be germinated, these definitely could. I used a paper towel method to confirm this, and after a couple of days, all of the seeds I tried germinated. I planted three seeds each into two small one-gallon fabric pots with a mix of peat moss, perlite, and vermiculite. And then just set it to a 12-12 hour light cycle right away because I just wanted to see how the industrial hemp matures in the flowering stage. I'm also watering with a hydroponic nutrient mix since the grow medium that I'm using contains no soil. So this could be considered a hydroponic type of setup. I took out one of the seedlings from the left pot to try something new with it. So now we're left with five plants. The two plants on the left pot are growing really well, while the middle seedling in the right pot is the only one growing at the same fast pace. The plants are developing at a rapid pace now, early on into the grow. And the first thing I noticed was how fast these plants are maturing with the male pollen sacs and the female flowers starting to develop in about two weeks time, with both plants on the left turning out to be males, and two of the three plants on the right turning out to be females. I left the males in the grow tent with the females to see how long the pollen sacs would take to develop. And it took about three weeks for them to fully mature and open up. While the female plants in just a month and a half were completely matured and producing fully formed hemp seeds. Physically, you can see that the flower density of the female plants are significantly smaller than that of a medicinal hemp plant, and that the plant is long and stocky, perfect for textile use if it was given a little more time in the vegetative stage. And that's pretty much it. Since I let the female plants pollinate, I wasn't able to test the CBD content in the plant. But I'll be doing one more industrial hemp grow with just the female plants so that I can send in for testing to show the differences in CBD content between industrial hemp and medicinal hemp in a future grow log. Like the content? Then be sure to check out our beginner's guide to creating CBD products from scratch, available at Amazon in print and digital, with links in the description below. 
You can also find us at hempinapot.com.